Shalom, brothers and sisters. The Biden admin will sue any state that tries to stop the border invasion. How does that sound like normal leadership to you or someone that's got the country's best interests at heart? Uh, the Biden administration has sued Arizona Governor Doug Ducey on Wednesday this week over his construction of a barrier made of double stacked shipping containers along the U.S.-Mexico border. So because he made a barrier, he has been sued. The lawsuit says the court must recognize and order Arizona to stop building the barrier and remove the containers in the valley, citing operational and environmental concerns. He is trespassing on federal lands, the complaint says. In installing shipping containers on national forest lands, Arizona has widened roads and cleared lands for staging areas, cut down or removed trees, clogged drainages and degraded the habitat of species on the Endangered Species Act. How ridiculous is this? The Biden admin is ruthlessly fighting any effort to stop the illegal invasion because it wants the invasion, needs the invasion to go on. It's also suing Texas for putting up floating barriers on the Rio Grande to prevent illegal invaders from swimming across. The Justice Department warned officials in Texas on Thursday that the federal government will sue the state unless it removes the barriers set up in the middle of the Rio Grande to repel migrants entering the USA. And then just tied to that article, New York City planning to house 1,000 border crosses in mental hospital parking lot. There are currently more migrants than homeless Americans in the city system more arriving every day. The city is going to use the parking lot as a camp for adult men seeking asylum in the United States. The center will provide not just a place to stay, but a critical services place to support individuals on their journey. It's, uh, it's mental, which is why they're now using a mental hospital's parking lot. The whole Biden administration is mental completely and being run from... Obama's basement, in my opinion, and whoever's pulling the strings above that as well. It's evil, sick, and twisted. And it's a sad situation to see unfolding on a once great nation. So, hectic. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.